Hello, hello. Testing, testing. Can you hear me? Can you see me? Hello, 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 hello. Happy Wednesday. I'm just getting set up. So if you can hear me, see me, leave me a comment. I just want to make sure we're here. Whoops, go back. Mm. Mm. Oh, goodness. Oh, my goodness. So many comments. Okay. I hear you. I hear you. I hear you. <laughs> okay. Okie dokie. I need to move things around a little bit. I See, I'm just learning. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, that's why I can't see it. Oh, wow. Hi, everybody. Yes. Oh, my goodness. Hello, Anne, Aaron, Floor, uh, Cindy, Linda, Aaron, hello, hello, Jane, oh my girl, Deborah, Diane, let me, um, let me entertain you. Okay, I'm looking, I'm trying. <laughs> hello, I'm here. All right. I'm learning. Hi, Bambi. Hi, Donna. Hi, Sherry. Uh, Janine, can you hear me? No. Misty, there I am. You guys, I'm going to end up putting my hair up. Tried. You have no idea how excited I am to paint tonight because I haven't been able to paint in forever. How is the lighting? Does it make me look 20 years younger? I'm just curious. I'll settle for two years younger. Um, helps if you turn the sound up. <laughs> Martha, I can't help you. I can't come over and do that. Okay. Um, yeah, y'all have to, y'all have to do your part. So let me just tell you, oh, today is our anniversary, Donna. So Donna is my business partner. I have to say business partner. Donna, I'm going to talk about that. Happy anniversary, my business partner and friend. Um, all right. I'm going to put my hair up. I can't. Happy anniversary. Wow. I love it. That brings tears to my eyes. All right. Cheers. Thank you, Darla. Hello. I look like I'm 15. I'll take it. All right. You guys, uh, you realize I'm making a lot of changes in my studio and um, I'm live on YouTube and I'm live on my Facebook page and I'm going to talk to you right now. It's 531. Welcome. My name is Tracy Weinzapfel. You're live in my studio. Karen Mooney just said, I look skinny. I don't know who that person is in the skinny camera, but no, <laughs> I may look skinny, but that's not happening. So let me just tell you, um, thank you, Donna, for reminding me. Today is our two-year anniversary. Um, by the way, my business partner and I started your artful journey, and it was one of those moments where Donna goes, oh, wait a minute, we're already live. And... Um, like, I'm a perfectionist. I overthink things. I want it to be perfect. I want it to be so perfect that I'm probably never, ever going to release it into the world. But we released it and we went live. And your artful journey um, was blossomed from that. If you're wondering what your artful journey is, and by the way, I just remembered, if you're wondering what your artful journey is, that is our membership group that you can belong to, which by the way, by the way, 
um, today new content was released. If you go to your artful journey right there, you can get on the wait list. If you are curious about being a member, we just released the new content today. And I just want to thank everybody. I was getting lots of love and I was at work. So it was kind of like, um, um, just crazy. And we have a lot going on. So I'm going to talk about it. You're going to get a free demo tonight, by the way. Um, yes, I've been talking about fitness and moving and family. And my life is really busy right now. I have two kids moving away to college, my last two. Um, so it's bittersweet for me this week. And I've got a, I'm feeling the feels. Does that make sense? I'm feeling the feels. And um, I leave at Friday at like uh, 4 a.m. We're just working. Uh, literally, I just walked in and we're working it out. And I'm setting up my new studio and the lighting. So I, I am just a mishmash, a mishmash of whatever happens, happens. So today, just bear with me. And thank you. Uh, I'm going to bring all of that into what we're doing today. If you have never seen me live, I create with no content in mind. Um, I will sometimes think of colors. I will sometimes think of, you know, a flower or whatever. I'll ask about colors. We will paint in about four, in about 10 minutes. Okay. Just give me a minute. Um, I do have a big announcement today. My business partner has been working our keister off and Anne as well. Um, we released the next challenge. I'm going to give the link. I'm sure Anne is already on the link. She probably is. The next challenge, by the way, is um, it's. so cool i'm super happy because it's the great fall heart art challenge and it starts september 20th uh let me see if i can share this with you hold on hold on hold on i know we have it okay i'm gonna share this right now hold on <laughs> Okay, your Artful Journey members, please don't run and go sign up for this. <laughs> uh, the challenge is included to you for free. That is what we're doing. Um, I, I love it because it's, uh, let me show you that. That's a little bit bigger. The cost is $10. You might be wondering, what is a challenge? Um, a challenge is where every morning at 8 a.m., we are going to do pretty much a page a day kind of thing. Um, and then um, this challenge is four days. Um, we're going to do all three of the pages that I'm sharing in front of you. And um, I'm quite thrilled because um, I got to work in hearts, which I'm not a big heart person. But I, I love to hide hearts in my art. And I've done that for a long time. Um, it is free to your Artful Journey members. It is free to your Artful Journey members. You will automatically be accepted into that private Facebook group. Please do not sign up for that. Um, okay. Okay, and I'm just going to show the banner for that so you all can see um, that across the screen a little bit. Um, that just came together, by the way. So I have been, I heard pumpkins, I heard sunflowers. So it was like, why don't we do a sunflower and a pumpkin together? Um, I don't know. There's just something about a fall sunset that is all different colors this page by the way we incorporate real leaves so you're gonna do three pages and um i cannot wait it is september it's september 20th so uh, it finally fell together and it fell together you know sometimes i do like six or eight pages and then i just go nope 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 
And those all fell together. And actually I was looking at it and it was like, everyone needs a heart in all three of the pages. So if you are looking and you want to join uh, your Artful Journey members, I'm going to say this again, please don't sign up. We will take care of you. You will be in the group. Don't worry. You're, um, but the cost for non-members is $10. Okay. $10, $10, $10. So I'm super excited. Well, I want to show you this video. <laughs> Hold on. Let me see if I could do it. I don't think I'm that. I don't think I'm that coordinated, but if I am, it would be really quite fun. Oh, maybe I'm not. Uh, oh, I didn't save it. I didn't save it. I do want to share this though. I was getting really crazy. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, can you tell? I'm a little bit on the heart side. So um, that is it. That's it. And there's a heart in everyone. And yes, you can share this link with all of your friends. Thank you so much. Yes, anybody can join. It's $10. Beginners are welcome. I want everybody to join in. I want this to be the biggest challenge I've done yet. We've done them and I'm thrilled. So thank you so much. If you want, um, if you want to share it, it's $10. Uh, oh, I just joined. What's included with members that cost $10. Uh, so your Artful Journey member, this is free to you guys because anything that we do, the challenges in the art journal are free. Uh, oh, oh, I like I should show some of these comments, especially when they're like, oh wait. Oh, I didn't grow any pumpkins in my backyard. I did not this year. Thank you, Jackie, for saying that. Tracy is an amazing teacher. If you're on the fence, join up in the challenge. I didn't grow any random pumpkins this year. Uh, if if um, I didn't, th that was an accident, by the way. I didn't grow them. They accidentally did that. So the date is June, um, or, sorry, September 20th. Uh, Janine, if you're asking the date of the challenge, if you're asking me on a date, uh, dinner tomorrow would be great. I'm kidding. I'm moving a kid into college. Um, so going to get my paints out of hiding and do this. Thank you, Dina. I have, um, yes, you can share the link out to friends. And here, I'll show the, I'll show this comment. <laughs> I do love it when a plan comes together. So thank you so much. Um, thank you, thank you, thank you. I I don't know what to say other than, um, oh, hold on. I'm trying to figure out how to unshare my comment. <laughs> okay. Okay, well, here, I'll show this one. All of Tracy's classes, prompts, and challenges are so fun. Okay, thank you. Um, thank you, Hitomi. We are going to paint. I have four minutes. Okay. The other thing I want to say is art journaling for beginners. I keep getting asked. Art journaling for beginners um, is another group that is free. Anybody who wants to join art journaling for beginners is welcome to go there. Um, I keep getting asked about doing a demo. So just so you know, the second Saturday of every month, second Saturday, it's not going to be just me. It's going to be um, guest uh, as well. But the first one I'm going to kick off, Jelly Arts has so nicely um, decided to uh, sponsor this. So I get to bring my worlds together in art journaling for beginners. So mark your calendars for September 11th if you were looking for more fun. Okay, Carla said, if I'm on the wait list for art journaling for be or your artful journey, do I need to sign up? The wait list is only to be notified first when the doors to your artful journey open. So yes, I highly recommend that you do sign up for the challenge because I'm going to announce it in the challenge first and the doors are going to open there. What supplies are needed? That's a great question. If you click on the link, um, all the supply, hold on, I better, I, I'm going to make the supply list is listed. The supply list is there. The supplies are not included. 
and I'm going to give you, I'll give you a little chit chat. I'll read while I'm talking. So I recommend an art journal, basic watercolors. I give you the colors that I suggest, uh, paint brushes. I give you the paintbrush sizes, painters tape, some Sharpies, nothing crazy, a black stamp pad. Um, I even say go out and pick leaves outside. So um, if you're having any issue signing up, all you need to do is send an email to support at your artfuljourney.com. And I'm sure Anne or somebody can give that link. <sighs> Okay. And by the way, my new filming, everything is going to um, start. Uh, uh, it's going to be all put together this Sunday. Darla Foreman, here we go. Let's do a little chitty chat. I am going to be live in Oklahoma. I think it's called Midwest City. Is it Oklahoma City? Darla, help me. Painting Palooza. She gave the link October 23rd through the 30th. Thank you so much, Darla, for that. Yes, I'm going to be live teaching. I cannot wait. I am very excited about that. So um, that is in October. And then the following weekend, guess what? I am going to my own retreat in person. Okay, both Oklahoma City or Midwest City. There you go. I knew, I knew it was close. Thank you, Darla. I'm teaching two art journaling classes. They're live. There is still room in my classes. I just ordered all of the journals. By the way, if you're looking to email and you're having an issue signing up, there is Anne, our community ambassador's beautiful face, beautiful friend, beautiful partner, and uh, she's our community ambassador. You can help her. Uh, you can email her if there's any questions. Okay, is the, uh, this is a watercolor uh, challenge, but there are some acrylics. I list a couple of acrylics, okay? You know what? I need to see myself in another place. I, I love this. Hitomi just, um, Hitomi just said that I'm a whole different level. Thank you, Hitomi. I don't know if that's a good thing. Um, <laughs> I am a... a I'm a teach to the whole room. Yeah. Anne is our community ambassador and she helps us run everything. I'm just going to turn the comments on down below. So, ooh. okay. That way I can see what's going on. Okay. Any other questions? Uh, I think there was another question. Does the heart art challenge have to be watched live or can it be watched later? Oh, excellent question. Oh my goodness. Thank you for that question, Jane. The answer is, um, Thank you, Jane. I love that. The answer is you do not have to watch them live. They are all recorded. You can watch them for um, 30 days after we're done. So um, they're in a private Facebook group. If you watch them live, I answer the questions as they come to me and I repeat the questions so people aren't guessing if they're recorded. And um, Darla just said you in person is the highest level of fun and excitement. Oh, tuck the string in on my right shoulder. Thank you. Oh, sorry. That's the other shoulder. What time is the challenge? I, use, I do those at 8 a.m. Pacific Standard Time every morning. Uh, I, I, got, I got it. Sorry. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. At least it wasn't a wardrobe function or malfunction on the Janet Jackson level. It was just a um, hanging up issue. That would have been horrible. Thank you, Karen, for sending me stars. That was lovely. Okay. Obviously, my excitement level. We had a lot today that was announced, and it was just coming out left, right, and center. So thank you. Yeah. No mal no wardrobe malfunctions. Okay. So, um, yeah. I, 20th through the 24th. It No. 20th, 21st, 22nd, 23rd. Four days. Four days. <laughs> Bambi, I don't know how many days it is. One, two, three. I do Q&A at the end. Four days. I don't know. Thank you for saying it's a nice shirt. <laughs> at least I'm not popping out of it. Okay. Um, today, I, oh, I, sorry. <laughs> you, 
Y'all know how it's how long it's been since I've actually been able to paint in a while. Four days. Thank you. Hi, Pat. I'm really happy to finally see you too. You look fabulous. <laughs> Pat's wondering if can they see me? Um the postcard class. Oh, yeah, you should do that too. <laughs> I don't have a link for that. Sorry. Yes, that was a fabulous class. All right. You know that philosophy of if you build it, they will come. I'm looking. Oh, sorry. I have all my stuff uh, kind of spread out because um, I put all my supplies for the challenges in a separate bin. So I need to remember that. I, I keep them all separate. All right. We are going to paint. I'm sorry. I had a lot going on. It feels like I. It, it's been over a week since I've been live and it hasn't been. So um, while I'm speaking, I can do this. I, oops. Uh, uh, uh. Can y'all see that? Okay, good. Can I join the challenge someplace else? Remember, if you remember, don't sign up. I need more hours in the day. Deborah, you and I both. All right. So we're going to talk right now while I'm, oh, that was, that was effective. Oh, wait, does that fit across there? Oh, that was effective. Don't throw it away. That would be a waste of tape. All right. So I'm going to, yeah, I've been making lots of changes. Um, my technology, oh, like the split screen. Look at this stuff. Watch, hold on. Let's just do that. Y'all want to see me? I don't really want you to see me while I'm painting. Is that a limited time availability? I couldn't find that answer. Cindy, drop an email to support, but no. Once you sign up, that goes in your portal and you'll get that. Yes, you guys, I am. All right, I'm just taping. Look at is anybody really <laughs> breath. This could all go to heck in a handbasket. Do you know how long it took me to get the lighting? Um, my friend is coming over. Brad is coming over on Sunday. And I got a video camera with lighting. And um, he, we're going to set that up. And he's going to teach me how to use it. Right now, I'm not using anything near as good. So, um we're going to do that on Sunday. Is there a place to ask questions while you're not live? Um, yes. Support at your art. Uh, yes. Yes, there is. Uh, Anne, can you drop your email out there again into um, internet land? Anne is the, um, the be all know all. Pat, just so you know, I read that is there a Q&A where you can ask questions when I'm not alive. And then I was thinking, I hope that doesn't happen. Uh, what kind of friend is Brad? A technology friend. <laughs> By the way, anybody in Art Masters? I'm going to tell you what kind of friend. I'm going to tell you what kind of friend Brad is. Anybody in Art Masters? Um, excuse me? That's what kind of friend Brad is. Brad will be here. I, I should get Brad behind the scenes. Uh, Loretta, I need an Ann. I'm sorry. Ann's taken. I love, I love Ann. All right. Um, do you guys want me to leave the camera like this? Are we good to go? Um, so what size is the journal? I'm going to give you guys um, resources seems to be a number one question. I do. I just placed a huge order today for art journals. If you're looking for art journals, uh, by the way, I'm, uh, uh, I haven't asked permission. I'm, we're going to give, Brad is an art master. We're going to give that away in art masters, but I need to ask his permission first. I'll ask him. I will. I, I know, but okay. Cheers. I'm having a glass of wine behind the scenes. Um, you know what, you guys, I all have to laugh that um, anytime I mention any male name, I get 6,000 people who go, hmm. All right. So single is good. Uh, let's paint today. Um this is my Sennelier set, and I also grabbed my classics and my um, Odyssey set. 
All of these are listed in my resources on my resources page. So if you want that, the link was just given and I can flash that up there. Oh, you guys, thank you because you we love you and we want you loved on. <laughs> that sounds dirty. All right, let's paint. Uh, I need a brush. That's going to be helpful. Uh, what are we going to paint today? You're wondering. I have something in mind, but I need colors. You guys are so sweet. I feel like I have. Oh, that looks pretty. Should we keep it simple or should I go? What do you want me to do? Thank you, Anne, for showing that. Here is Anne. Just in case you have any questions, she is a wonderful person to um, contact. By the way, if this is anybody's first time watching me, my name is Tracy Weinsapple. We're going to paint. I don't preconceive or practice what we're going to paint. I just kind of paint what's in my heart, mind, and soul. I got a lot going on, obviously. And I, uh, in less than two weeks, my little nest is going to be empty. Uh, my last, my twins, I have 20, what year? 20 year old, 19 year old twins who are both leaving for college in one week. So t Friday and then the following Friday. So it's pretty, um, it's pretty emotional. Pat, just to let you know, um, I'm going to, I'm working in watercolors tonight, which is great. Every third Wednesday I work in acrylics and mixed media. So, um, there you go. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate. I do have a couple of screens. I, I, I need to take a behind the scenes so you can see, but I can see it on two big monitors. Uh, so I am watching for questions. If it looks like I get pretty involved, it just means I'm, I'm lost in the moment. And that's not a bad place. It's not a bad space to be. Let's just keep this as simple as possible. And I'm going to grab my classics and, um, Oh, my, my paint sets are a little dirty. They're, they're, uh, 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 uh. all right. So what are we going to paint today? How about a cone flower? Uh, I don't know why, but I just, uh, where are you going? Come back here. Uh! Okay. Maybe <laughs> this book isn't large enough for that. All right. I'll just do this. This keyboard doesn't need to be here anyway. All right. Y'all can see that still. Right. Yeah, I got plenty of room. What am I doing? I got plenty of space. See, I'm not used to this. So we're just, we're going to just, um, we're going to just paint. This is an awfully large brush. Maybe I should downsize it. Now, um, I am not by any means, uh, a trained professional. I am just one who likes to experiment with paints, paints and let it go. So that's pretty much, uh, it's the smallest size I can find here. Oh, God. Mm -mm. I'm just grabbing a smaller brush because everything I have, is, I have out is super huge. So I'm going to use, um, Sharon, that was my Sennelier set. Uh, that is listed on my resources page. It's one of my favorite sets, and um, it's listed. So I'm using the classic set. I'm just deep. I'm diving into the pink and the white, or the, yeah, I guess I'm pink, diving into the pink and the white. And then I'm going to come over here because I've got Rome in Tokyo in the Odyssey set, and look at how fun this is. So basically, uh, basically, I love to experiment with paints. Uh, I love, I, I, I am definitely somebody who likes to deep dive into things that are water-based. I love acrylics. I love watercolors. That is my, my jam. Is that like an old thing to say? But that is really how I exist in this little world of creativity. I don't work in oils, so... Um, it's just not, I, I'm, I'm a neat freak. I, I like to be really clean and it's just not my thing. So if you're looking for that, I'm sorry. You probably won't get a lot of that here. Uh, somebody just asked what's difference between painting and mixed media. I think that was a question I, I 
wasn't really stare. Um, so mixed media for me is more acrylics and gel mediums. And um, I, I, I can mix, by the way, I could do mixed media with watercolors as well. So that's just a mixture of things. Um, today I am really primarily just using watercolors and that's just because that's the space I like to sometimes create from. Now I'm just dipping into black here and I'm gonna, I like to, I don't know. I'm one of those people who buy supplies and encourages people to use the supplies that they buy. If you are a collector, I understand it's a fun thing to collect, but I encourage you to actually use the paints that you buy. It's, it's a crazy thing. And I'm, I, I'm going to tell you from the bottom of my heart, you know, let's, let's use the things that you buy. And I love watercolors, of course. You know, I am going to use acrylics on this today. We're going to mix it up a little bit. But do you see, we're just we're just playing. Love these colors. Oh, excellent. Okay, and you, you guys can still see me. Is it? Do you still? Oh. Mm. I painted this wine glass. All right. I wonder why I had comb flowers on my brain. I don't know. I feel like this the 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 head of this flower got really large and crazy. Um so let's let's go out Uh, another thing I say about painting is we're going to hit the uglies. Who's painting with me tonight? I always encourage people to paint right along and just go for it. So if you're going for it, that's even better. Um, but we are going to hit some uglies. And if we hit the uglies, don't, don't pump the brakes. Just keep going. All right. That just keep going. Now, um, I don't really know about a background or a, I don't even know if this needs a base. I think we're just going to mix some yellows. Of course, my yellows are all jacked up. I, I do want this to dry a little bit because I don't want everything good. People are raising their hand. I'm going to dry this. This is a um, just a heat gun. Uh, like hair dryer will work. The other thing about me in painting, I really want you to use the supplies that you buy crazy concept. The other thing is I highly recommend that you start with just basic supplies, a, a basic watercolors, uh, a Sharpie fine and ultra fine. Don't go break the bank until you figure out what you really like. Um, and I can teach you, you know, like we can do this together as much as you want. All right. See Donna, happy anniversary. Happy anniversary. All right. This is yellow because my other yellow is just gone. Do you, do you like how I mix? My watercolors are always dirty. So I'm going to just. I'm going to. We're going to make grass down here. It's not going to look like grass. It's just going to be implied grass. Impressionism glass or grass. All right. And then I'm going to dip in green. I don't need this painting to be absolutely literal. Ooh, that is a deep green. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. All right. I kind of want to, that's okay. Do, 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 do. Now, some of you might be saying she is really hitting the uglies early. Well, I'm wondering the same thing, but that's okay. There's another green over here that's a little softer. Oh, there we go. I'm not worried. We'll hit them. We'll, we'll try to get out of it.
Everybody good? I really feel like I just deep dive. Oh, my wedding anniversary is Friday. Happy anniversary. 49 years. I love it. I wanted to say that's longer than I've been alive, but it's not. All right. So you might be wondering why am I just crisscrossing? I don't know. I just feel like it. It's the mood I'm in and... I can make more grass down here, by the way. And I, all right. So now we need a sky. Here comes the sun. Do, 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 do. I really want a particular color. I just want a particular, I know I'm really, I could mix some colors to get it, but I'm sorry. I'm going to, I'm going to go for something. I want, I, 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 I'm a sucker for teal. Uh, this might be a little too green. Hold on. Is it too green? Oh, yeah, it's right here. It's right here. And I'm going to try and not. Is it there? Nope, that's too green. See, I told you I was going to green. It's hard to tell with these sets. Is this? Nope, that's too green. I think it's this one right here. Oh, yeah, that'll work. Maybe even this. No, no, no. Hotter, colder, hotter. You just mix the colors and then you get them. By the way, if you're not mixing your watercolors, which normally I do. So this is the Sennelier set. I was saying this is a French company and I do I do like them. I, I love Daniel Smith. I, um, I'm just, I'm not gonna put a lot of like craziness in the background. I just, mm, yes, we're hitting the uglies. I get it, we're there. But this is where I say to you, please carry on and don't let it get to you. What's this color over here? See, I like to mix colors. Yeah. And I got that song in my head. Here comes the sun. Do, 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 do. Do I prefer Dan? I love, I love Daniel Smith. I love Daniel Smith. Uh, also, I, I, yeah, I love Daniel Smith colors. Uh, Sennelier is really great too. Um, there's another one, Holbein I like. If you're looking for like fine art watercolors, there's a big difference. Um, you might notice I use a lot of these sets by Prima. I love them because they're portable and they're small. And a lot of people get their paints and they start mixing them and and that's fine too. I don't, you know, like putting them, I don't like to carry a lot of stuff with me. If I'm painting on the go, if I'm in the DMV and I'm painting on the go, I don't want to have a huge set like this of watercolors. It looks a little obnoxious on an airplane, but if you pull something out like this, also, I love to challenge myself. Um, I, I, that that's the difference, you know, for me. So People ask me all the time what watercolors, and I, I, I don't know. I can't pick a favorite. It's like picking a favorite child. Michaela, kidding. <laughs> She's all packed. <laughs> Shh, don't ever point this out. There is no ugliest with this one, Tracy. Oh, I love it. Oh, okay. So now I'm going to dry this because we're going to, we're going to, um, I like when, so here's the thing about Wednesday nights, the demos I do Wednesday night, they're free, they're loose, they're fun. Your artful journey members, we deep dive, we learn, uh, which by the way, all of you have been asking about liner work. That's going to happen. Um, this, this month is butterflies, but we pick different techniques or themes or whatnot. And we, we study that for 30, uh, for the month. I was going to say 30 days. So Wednesday nights are free and they're fun. And that is just what I like to do and how I like to share my art. So a lot of people say to me, oh, it goes too fast. Well, um, I'm sorry. 
wait, sorry, not sorry. Um, I like to be done because I have to eat dinner, dinner by 6.30 or I spontaneously combust. Uh, do we need to bring watercolors to Oklahoma? I highly recommend if you, um, I'm going to bring watercolors to share, but I know that there are a few of your paint, of you painters who are much neater and clean. And by the way, I have OCD, but I like to use my paint sets. Um, so I recommend that you bring your own watercolors if you have them. That way yours, you have yours to use and pick your own colors. But I'm just going to bring ones to share. It's just, just know that mine are going to be well loved. Do I do this every Wednesday? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. And it's free. Every third Wednesday is mixed media. Thank you, Melody, for asking. I love your art, Tracy. I found you on YouTube from Canada. Well, thank you, Carrie Ann. <laughs> I always want to make a joke because my mom watches on YouTube and I always make a joke to my mom like, oh, did you see my other channel, mom? She thinks I, I have a side gig. I don't have a side gig, just so you know. This is my side gig. All right. Um, I, I'm grabbing some things out of my bin. Uh, this is my bin for the, um, oh, here they are. Okay. I'm not grabbing anything that is special. All right. I'm grabbing uh, ultra fine and fine Sharpie. When you do this, you want to make sure your artwork, artwork is dry because you don't want to go running in here with uh, your Sharpie. You'll ruin them. How many people are going to do this? All right. So we're going to paint. Do No, we're going to draw now. It's funny because I'm watching this on the screen and what I see is incredibly ugly. But all right. Oh, let's get a pen that works. So I'm not going to worry about what I thought were the lines. It would be nice if this pen worked, though. Um, my Sharpies are about like, I need to order dozens more, but if anybody is listening from the car company of Sharpie, uh, and you want to sponsor me, um, you can send me just fine and ultra fine black Sharpies. Um, you can also send me the chisel tip. I'm putting it out in the universe cause you never know. You know, what's funny guys is I, so I'm just starting to sketch. This is Basically, I'm starting to scribble, but I want to see where my flower is. What's it saying to me? What's the paint saying? I had a little ponding here. That wasn't ideal. You know, should this a petal have come out? Yeah, but eh. Don't get fixed on what you think it should be. Just see where it takes you. That's what I suggest. Hmm. I believe in putting it out into the universe and I don't know that Sharpie would ideally love me because I really just go through dozens and dozens of their black pens. I don't really use the other ones too much. That's feeling pretty good though. Does it look like a cone flower at least? <laughs> Hello, Deborah. Thank you. We were waiting for you. So we're going to get started now. I always love, I always love when people join in and they're like, oh my God, I missed it. So um, this video is available on my YouTube channel and it's also, I'm not going to go overboard in here because I decided I'm going to use some acrylic paints in here. Um, I found you watching Joyce's BoQ Creations Live and you were on there. Well, thank you, Joy. I love Joyce. Will it work with a micron pen? Absolutely. I love a good permanent pen. A, a good micron pen will work. Yep. Listen, if you try this with a ballpoint pen, it'll work. It's probably not going to spontaneously combust. I'm an experimenter of all natures. So I always love when people say, will this work? And I'm like, yeah, it will. And if it spontaneously combusts, 
then you got a problem. <laughs> That's why I pretty much work in water-based items. So this is now a fine Sharpie and it's just, I'm going down in all of those, you know, random petals that I created. I don't know, right? All right, so now I'm going to do this and we're going to start seeing this cone flower come to life. Because, yes, I'm just dotting. In fact, I'm, yeah, how did you guys find me? That's nice to know. Let's, let's chit chat. So I'm just dotting. Oh, wait, I have new comments. <laughs> totally a cone flower. Okay. All right, then I'll keep going. So. So really what I like to do is just come in here and it it the, it will kind of just talk to me and say, you know, this is what I want to do and this is what I want to be. And am I sure about what's going on down here? Anne says, I found you on Mixed Media Mondays, which means she has owned me since then. All right. I'm going to take a drink out of my cone flower. <laughs> All right. So if you're in your artful journey group, I can't see everybody's name. Um, I found you on an es escalator in Columbus, Ohio. <laughs> All right. Now, this is where I say we're going to go a little mixed media. I love a good Quinn, 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 a cry down gold and Payne's gray. This is where I'm going to, oh, that I can't use that one out. That one's brand new. Oh, you guys. Somebody once found me in a Target. And I felt like she was stalking me, and she wasn't. It was a really nice lady who, um, who did find me in a Target. <laughs> oh, you guys are so sweet. All right. So this is, now we're in mixed media. Uh, I'm glad you find me guys to see one of the art parties. All right. I'm going to use a stencil brush, which is basically a very, uh, nubby short. I'm looking for one. Here we go. Well, this is kind of large, but that's okay. So I'm going to take this. This is, um, quinacridone gold. Oh, Jelly Arts. I work for Jelly Arts too. So I'm going to take this. I love this because this is like, it's kind of like rust in a bottle is what I say, but oh, whoops. I went way outside because who cares about the lines? And then this is Payne's gray. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to see I'm, yep. Uh, Da, 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 da. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Do you see how like <laughs> oh and you know what would look really good is just a little bit of yellow. Oh my god, Patty, I'm from Michigan. Michigan State girl. Born and raised. I live in Southern California. Oh, look at that. Look at that. This cone flower now. It decided that it is happy. Do you see how that just took shape and it just got all? Oh, uh, look at that. I'm happy about that. So you see, it's a lot of brushing off. All right, done. So uh, mixed media, we mixed media. Yes, we mixed media right there. Huh. Now, I'm kind of feeling like I love a good stamp pad. So I'm going to pull a couple of them out. Remember when I did this with the green that one time? I have a stencil brush that I use just for... Um, 
Oh, Jackson, Michigan. I'm originally from Detroit, moved to Brighton, and then I went to Michigan State. And then I bought a one-way ticket to San Diego in 1992, May 4th, on my birthday. Stamp pad. This is a distressed uh, Ranger. Uh, it's green. What color is it? I love these little peeled paint. This is on my resources page. This is where I'm going to go in here. And remember my lovely, oh, you know what? I thought of another idea. Oh, you guys, you're getting like enough. This is craziness today. I decided one other thing I'm going to do. And then I'm going to call this a day. Okay, it's six. Okay, I'm going to finish this. I, I never not finish it. So Fenton, Michigan. Look at the, all of my Michigan people. The real question is it U of M or Michigan State? Because that's the real question. And there's only one right answer in this situation. And you better say Michigan State. Go green. All right. So this is just a stamp pad. And I love this. I keep one stencil brush. It's This is a, stenc a stencil brush pro. Um, this is, um, I love it. I keep it for ink only. And that's what I use it for. Uh, and I do that on purpose. So I went around the edges. I just did that. Okay, now I thought of one other thing and then I'm done. This is, I'm calling it done. Sharon Lansing, Michigan. Oh, hold on. I'm gonna take some green acrylic paint if I have some handy. I, and this turned into more of, oh, this is sap green. That'll work, I think. <sighs> Does anybody phalo green yellow? That'll work. Thank you, Go Spartans. Uh, Deborah, you can now watch anytime you want. And then one other color, green gold. You guys, I didn't intend for this to be the way it is, but I can't help myself and I can't stop once the, I, this is it. This is a magic uh, hotel key that I got uh, at the Marriott Rewards. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> well, y'all, I hope you come back and watch me again. Cause yes. Oh, I gotta, I gotta like lay something down here. Cause I feel like I'm going off the edge and Fowlerville, you know what? Um, when I was a kid and I would go to the Fowlerville Fair every year in Michigan, one year I came back and told my parents I was going to join the circuit or join the fair and I was going to move. And I was like a high school in college or I, I, I was a senior, like a junior in high school, like wasn't even finishing school. Like, mom, I'm going to join the fair. That's what I, I think I told my parents that. <laughs> and it was the Fowlerville Fair. I didn't realize that they travel all over the world and, what was I going to do? And I didn't, I wasn't a bearded lady. I didn't have a talent. It was just, I was going to join the fair. So anyway, that's my story. My poor parents. <laughs> that's when they said, oh, you're going away to school. <laughs> you don't have an option here. <laughs> Look at that Payne's gray. We'll just, we'll just dump into all of that. All right. Melody said, I will definitely be here again. I, I really threw a lot at you. This was a free demo that, by the way, I love when you all share what you're painting. Um, this isn't a magic room key, by the way. This is just a room key. But isn't that fun? Now we have grass. Now we have grass. And you didn't even know it. You didn't even know that room key that you should be hanging at. I'll just use the rest of this paint. All of this stuff is on my resources page. I am a deco art maker. All of these paints are by deco art that I use that are acrylic, not the watercolors. And uh, you can order from them and use my uh, affiliate code. Oh, that's really wet. Um, so Leslie asked, what times the fall challenge start and end each day? It starts at 8 a.m. We'll be done by 9, 8 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Oh, this, you guys, this was, this was great. I'm going to finish one other thing. Oh, I'm really moving over. Mm -hmm. uh, Angelica just said, beautiful, joining in late on vacation in Maine, and I forgot about your live. Well, Angelica, it wasn't really nice of you to go on vacation and not invite us. <laughs> mm. 
it's okay. Eight, nine, 10, 11 Eastern time. And if you ask me about it, and, and it's all recorded. Don't forget, it's all recorded. I'm going to do one other thing. Um, this is an aquarellable. Um, this is an aquarellable pencil. It's activated by water. Um, and you can, it's water, remember, water base. I'm just going to come in here and just, we're just going to, I want to take the, I'm taking the, I always take the, the tape off. I still have five minutes. Does anybody feel like I, so I managed to do this. So this is on the supply list. I do list everything on the supply list. Don't run out and go buy everything and panic that you don't have everything. Watch the videos. See what you like. Okay, don't, I, I'm not, it's never good to be an affiliate for somebody and say, oh, don't run out and buy it. But I want you to see what you like. That's what I want you to do. I want you to find your art voice. See what speaks to you. But this was, this just shows you don't have to have like this expectation of what it's going to turn out. Let it go. Let it go. All right. I think that's it. <laughs> Although I really want to do a little bit like, I feel like this was an interpretive dance that I did. All right. Um, this is now black Ranger ink, just black. I, I decided that this needs, I need to just screw it up now because all this paint is soaking wet and I just want to smear it and make myself mad because I'm so impatient. Oh, here, I'll just do this. And then, eh. yeah, actually that's working. It's I'm smearing it in the smear direction and ruining my stencil brush at the same time. Oh, well. Uh, if you're looking for really awesome brushes, uh, go to my blog on Tracy Weinzaffel Studios because I do uh, work with the brush guys and they have my brush sets and they're, it's actually not the brush guys anymore. It's the brush guy and his wife, but all right, uh, we're done. Pam says, thank you for being honest and affirming. Thank you. I, I don't have another, if you ask my friends, I don't have another space to come from. I, I am, um, this is it. Uh, it's time to take the tape off. Okay. Let's hope and pray that everything stayed within the tape. God. So it's just so gratifying. At the end of the day, y'all, this was kind of a mixed media project because I just couldn't help myself. Um, pencils down, paintbrushes up. Uh, we're done. I do share. Oh, I literally got so excited. My pages started coming out of my book. It was kind of random. It was, it was a random, was it perfect? No, it was a demo. Y'all do this and you show me amazing things. And um, Pat just said, I had a blast. I am actually not horrified <laughs> by my flower. Okay, that's what it's about. Let it go. Don't have an expectation of what it's supposed to look like. This is your flower, not my flower. I mean, that's it. It's the Mayflower. I don't um thank you so if you all want to create with me for the challenge in um september tw on september 20th 20 for four days with me create with me if you're curious about your artful journey you can go um and visit your artful journey let's see if i can show you uh da -da. let's do this okay um that's your artful journey. You can click on waitlist. If you're curious about what that is and deep diving into lessons that we do, 
that's exactly what you should do. You, um, Your Artful Journey members, please go right into our group and share your artwork. That is my most exciting thing that I get to see when I'm done. I do share my artwork when I'm done tomorrow on my page. You can always watch the YouTube uh, replay. You can watch it here on my page. Things don't disappear. They disappear when they're really cruddy, but that's by accident. And um, I just want to thank you guys. It's really wonderful to uh, create with you guys. One other thing I'm going to mention, and I will put this up, is don't forget to join the Great Fall Heart Art Journal Challenge. That is September 20th. Donna, my business partner in crime, thank you for two of the most amazing two years of my life that literally brought me back into my little art world. Um, if you build it, they will come was the motto that we used. And um, I couldn't be more grateful, thankful, and proud of what we're doing and the amazing empowered women. CJ Smith, I see you from Simple pleasures, scrapbooking. I love you. I miss you. Um, and Angelica just said, my lighting looks good. <laughs> thank you. We're tweaking things. Yes. So um, thank you. Thank you. Uh, by the way, uh, the team that supports me, by the way, is Donna, my business partner, and um, uh, uh, I've got social media, it, it, Madison. Uh, we just, I just want to thank you all because this is not me. This is all of us. It takes a team to make this work. And I thank you guys for making my dreams come true. Um, thank you so much for tonight's demo, Tracy. I really enjoyed it. Uh, going to try and do mine tomorrow with just watercolors. I'm still on vacations and my acrylics are home. Jean, by the way, you can take a brush and dab into like the black and do exactly what I did. So go ahead and do that. Um, and yes, thank you very much, Donna, for pushing that button. It was the most amazing thing. Because if you all wait for me, it's never going to happen because it has to be too perfect. So, all right, I'm going to go eat my dinner. And um, ex thank you for being so patient while we're working out everything that's working out in the studio. I'm trying. I'll take photos. People are asking me for my behind the scenes of what I have going. And I'm just trying to perfect it and not have a bunch of guys laughed at me. It, and by the way, I have cords. They're everywhere. There are cords connected to everything around here. So um, Jane said, thank you so much for spending time with us. Uh, thank you for spending time with me. All right. Uh, I will, I will see you guys all next Wednesday at 5 30 PM. I love you all. And this video is available. It's streamed live on YouTube. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to contact me personally and, or, and through support. And even if it's a question, she'll get it to me. Thank you so much. I will talk to y'all soon and enjoy. Do something creative every day. Talk to y'all soon.